Also, das Spiel ist in, heißt Invincible. Wir sind irgendwie auf einem fremden Planeten. Und das ist alles so im, im so in diesem 60 er jahres stil gehalten. Äh, wie man sich das früher so vorgestellt hat, wie es vielleicht auf anderen Planeten sein könnte. Dragonfly auf dem Weg. Die Dragonfly, eine kleine, aus sechs Mann bestehende Forschungseinheit des interplanetarischen Commonwealth, reist in entfernte Regionen des Weltraums. Nach der Erkundung zahlreicher Welten und unzähliger, unzähliger Planeten wurde die Forschungsmission für beendet erklärt. Auf dem Heimweg erwartet die Besatzung nur noch eine letzte Aufgabe. Alle, allen Risiken zum Trotz extrahiert Astrogator Norvik eigenhändig ein seltenes und unschätzbar wertvolles Mineral. Norvik beschafft zwar das Mineral, allerdings auf Kosten eines gebrochenen Beins und unerträglicher Schmerzen. Dennoch hält der Unfall des Astrogators niemanden davon ab, das Ende der Forschungsphase zu feiern. Es war eine Zeit, die von großen Erfolgen gekrönt war und in der innige Freundschaften entstanden. Mit sich zufrieden setzten sie Kurs auf ihre Heimat und freuten sich auf eine wohlverdiente Pause in ihren Kälteschlafkammern. Yay, Kälteschlafkammern! Yay, Bexy Gaming. Where am I? In a... On my head. Marit? Anybody? Das Spiel ist auf dem gleichnamigen Roman aufgebaut. Ne, nicht der Marsiana. Das Spiel heißt auch nicht der Marsiana quasi. <lacht> In zehn Minuten so. Ups, jetzt sind wir schon durch. Das ist ja schade. Ah. Oh Gott, wie mache ich denn das jetzt? Ah. Help. Uh, I need help. Base, would you please answer me? Are you there? Hello? Kovel? Marit? I saw you a second ago. I think. Dragonfly, come in. Oh, my head is killing me. Ah, I don't know what I'm doing here. Where I am exactly. Someone answer me, god damn it. Uh, soll ich ein bisschen lauter machen? <coughs> Okay. Nothing's broken. I can walk. Where's everyone gone? Why is no one answering me? Kontaktiere deine Besatzung. Aber ich dachte, wir sind alle in den Kälteschlafkammern. Scheint ja doch nicht so zu sein. Der Main Charakter heißt Jasna, bitte nicht mit Nasna verwechseln. <lacht> nach dem Missionsprotokoll. Just like I thought. Nothing. I'm on my own. The beacon can't be detected either. Das ist meine Brotdose. Let's see if the past me hasn't failed the present me. And let's hope she took notes. Kann sie sich nicht an ihre Vergangenheit erinnern? Are we in Regis 3? Doesn't ring any bells. 
My crew have no way to tell me. So I report that I have no recollection of this planet. The last thing I remember. Hang on. We've closed the research cycle. We, we were already in hibernation. Flying back. Is my blackout a side effect of metabolic depression? That would be bizarre. For some reason, our crew split into two groups. The first one set up camp. I wonder if I was with them. Or am I on my way there? Both groups landed in the same place. Landers to the surface. They usually do this. Maybe the first one broke. The first group explored the ocean with no biologist. It's weird. And the other one, just me, took a different route. Leading to. Right. I was heading straight to the camp. You must be somewhere near. Give me a sign. Send up a flare, the probe. Anything. Okay. I'm gonna head to the camp. But I'll be keeping an eye out for you. Give me a sign. Wo bist du? Well done, past me. He didn't disappoint after all. Oh, I sound like I need to stop doing this. Finde deinen genauen Standort heraus. I'm looking for something that resembles a dog. Das sieht aus wie ein Hund. A specific structure which does not resemble any. Was klar? Da hat doch sogar Zähne. Äh. <lacht> das ist ein bisschen zu nah. Und das checking another object which also doesn't match. Oh, focus. Schreib ins Buch, Generation Smartphone. That rope. I think it's mine. I'll try to retrieve it later. It might come in handy. Ah, das. Okay, das sieht mehr aus wie ein Hund. I found the dog. Viel Spaß, Liquid. I found the dog. The first one. I need one more. Nadel. Oder ein Krokodil. Ah, das andere ist das Krokodil. Okay. Na gut. That has an interesting shape of a crocodile indeed. I report that I have established my position. Time to hit the road. Okay. Da, da ist das Camp. Da habe ich aber einen weiten Weg vor mir. <lacht> also von der Grafik her finde ich das schon ziemlich cool, muss ich sagen. Sieht ja fast aus wie Mauern hier. Aber wahrscheinlich nicht. I'm in a canyon. Which doesn't make it easy to navigate. Oh, 
I hope the data's trustworthy and you're close by. Ich habe jetzt ein bisschen Angst gehabt, dass da noch mehr runterkommt. Komm ich hier hoch? Ja. Nee. Ich finde das so witzig, wie die läuft. Tracker. Oh, I have something on the tracker. I assume it's no one from the crew, so perhaps it's my beacon. Da, Mom, dass das Wasser trinken kann? Das ist die andere Frage. Warm. Oh, getting warmer. Got you. I found it. Look for me on your trackers. Was? Just wieder wegpacken? Another liquid that did not allow the biosynosis to form. Won't be easy to replenish drinking supplies. Not without tests. Filtration, as we all remember. Third rule. Have you checked on your I was about to. Already awake. Good. <gasps> yes, ma. Hmm? Yeah, I don't know if you're awake or whether it's a post-hibernation of praxia. No, I'm I'm awake. I'm awake. Just slowly. Now, try to get up slowly. Gorski doesn't look so well. How are you holding up, Gorski? Don't get up just yet. Is it really so hard for you to remember a couple of simple rules? I have to stretch my legs. Hibernation will do that. Just sit for a while. Here, take it and remember the third rule. Yes, I know. Stay hydrated. In small sips. Alle mal was trinken. Das ist nämlich die dritte Regel. Always the first one to get up. I don't know how you do it, Murray. It's a matter of habit. After so many cycles of cryogenic sleep, one either gets used to it or becomes a tortoise. Kovel, <sighs> will you help me here? <sighs> sure, I'm coming. This is not our system. Has anyone noticed we're in the wrong place? Kovel, it's not a good time. Yasna, look for yourself. This is not the right planet. You shouldn't be walking yet. Come on. Kovel, could you stop it? I'm telling you, we woke up in the wrong place. Yes, we heard you. Enough of this, Yasna. Crew. Astrogator. The bathing chamber in 15. We'll find out. But first, here, hold on to it and remember. Oh. 
Und was ist die erste Regel des Situation Clubs? Das werden wir bestimmt noch erfahren. <lacht> Hallo, Fane, Rob. Ob ich hier reingehen darf? Okay. Ich lautsche hier einfach durch. Ist zumindest keine Säure anscheinend. Alright. No time to lose. Bitte was dort? <lacht> okay. Time to go. Geht's aber weit runter. I found a way out of the valley, leading more or less towards the camp. Aber du hast doch einen Haken. Wie benutze ich denn meinen Haken? Da ist auch kein anderer, anderer was. Weg? Hier ist ein kleiner Texturfehler. <lacht> Mensch oder Lebensform, du bist alleine? So hast du aufgepasst, Extern. Nee, meine Crew ist doch mit mir hier anscheinend runtergegangen. Die hat doch vorhin in ihr Büchlein geguckt und hat festgestellt, ähm, dass die mit zwei Teams hier ausgeschwärmt sind, die sich getrennt haben. Aber wo sind die Gegner? Ach so, ich hoffe, es gibt keine. <lacht> also, ich hoffe, dass ich nicht gleich schreie, weil mich irgendwas anspringt. Oh, ich habe heute Mittag einen Film geguckt. Und da war schon beim... Also der ging zu Ende und ich war schon so bei, am Wegdösen und dann kam ein lautes Geräusch und da habe ich die Augen aufgemacht und da sprang so am, am Schluss des Filmes sprang ein noch so ein Vieh ins Gesicht. Wo habe ich geschrien? Ash outbursts and extreme temperature changes may explain the extinction of local fauna and flora. 
But it's all just too idyllic. There's no dust in the air. The sky is clear and the soil looks like laterite to me. Perhaps not highly fertile, but not entirely barren. Okay, die hat gerade schon gesagt, das ist eigentlich jetzt zu schön, um wahr zu sein. Zu idyllisch. Es sind immer mal ein paar Texturfehler, ne? Ja, sehr idyllisch finde ich auch. <lacht> Guck mal, da unten sieht ja ein bisschen... Das sieht ja... Das sieht ja, ähm... Aus, als würde dort was wachsen. Huch! Wer jetzt gerade irgendwas gehört? Oder so das. Also hier kann es nicht runter anscheinend. Ach so doch. Wenn mich jetzt was anspringt, weil es so dunkel ist, dann... Dann aber... Over 400 meters in a straight line. I, I see you. Can you hear me? I just need to get down from here. I can't get down this way. But I can secure the rope. Yeah? I'm reporting that I'm starting my descent. I'll be at the bottom soon. Was soll schon schief gehen? Kriege ich das jetzt wieder runter? Gar nicht. Das bleibt jetzt da, oder was? Ich hätte bestimmt auch runterlaufen können. Hat die nicht gesagt, es ist kein Staub in der Luft? Visibility could be better. Maybe I should wait. Wo 
das Eisen hin. Oh. Zack, weg war sie. <lacht> Hallo? Jasna? Jasna, geht's dir gut? Ist das aber nicht wieder am Ausgangspunkt, oder? Das wäre das wäre ja krass. Ah ne, da drüben ist das Lager. War doch gerade noch da auf der linken Seite des Blattes. Das ist ja crazy. Bitte nicht hier runterrutschen. Ähm. Soll ich denn da hochkommen? Hallo? Hallo? Wo oh, ausschicken mit dem Planeten da hinten? Ähm, wie kommt man denn hier hoch? Gar nicht. Ah, okay. Nee, man soll anscheinend irgendwie anders laufen. Ganz schön langer Weg zum Strand. <lacht> Vielleicht nächstes Mal ein anderes Hotel. Ja, da kann ja das Hotel nichts dafür, wenn diese Stände verirrt, ne? Und nun? Warte nur auf einen Jumpscare, ey. Und wieso stehst du jetzt hier? Hallo? Oh. Astrogator, Sir. Crew. Dr. Gorski. Right on time. Any updates? We have a set of data from a near surface probe. How's the activity? Zero, zero and two. So. Less than nothing. Atmosphere? Nitrogen, 78%. Argon, 2%. Carbon dioxide, 0%. Methane, 
The rest is oxygen. Uh, wait, that's 16%. With oxygen concentration as such, there should be life. At least some microbes, and yet we have detected no traces. Yeah, we'll get to that later. Let's finish with the probe readings first. Aber wer bildet denn den ganzen Sauerstoff? Virtually zero. In the words of paradise, no radioactivity, no endospores, no bacteria, no mold, no viruses, nothing. Just the oxygen. If there were no living organisms on the continent, there shouldn't be this much of it. What if life develops on some other continents here? No, I doubt it. Insulation outside the equatorial zone is weak. You don't see how thick the polar ice caps were, don't you? I can guarantee a minimum of five miles of ice sheet, potentially six. Mm, that's true. There's more chance of something in the ocean. Some seaweed, algae. But why didn't life migrate to the land? Could be because of hard radiation. Mm, I don't think so. According to the probe readings, the ground activity is exceptionally low for this part of the galaxy. I wonder if some special kind of drought intolerant evolution occurred here. And that would at least explain some of the abnormalities. Hmm. Anyway, we'll have to take a look under the water. First, it would be good to know what time frame we're working with. Come with some prote projector here now. Marit, do you have the geological analysis? It's a bit too early for mature conclusions, but this planet looks old to me. Such a fossilized egg must be at least six billion years old. Besides, the sun has seen better days too, so why still have to walk? Any rare resources, forms, creatures? We can't expect such detailed data, sir. Not from this distance. Yes, we would have to explore the surface. Astrogator, what exactly are we looking for? The value of this planet. For now it may seem like the pinnacle of nonsense. But I assure you that Regis 3 is not without worth. With all due respect, Astrogator, I have the impression you're not telling us everything. As always, Dr. Koval, your instincts are correct. Please forgive my reticence. My goal was to maintain unimpeded research neutrality. There is indeed a very important factor of interest in this planet. The Alliance. The Alliance? The Alliance? Correct. What do they have to do with it? Yeah, well, the Alliance! They've sent their most powerful unit here. But to our best knowledge, Condor's traversing a distant quadrant. Well, I'm not talking about the Condor. So, the Invincible? Good guess, Doctor. A steel behemoth with the power to produce billions of kilowatts in a split second, converting it into energy fields that no material body can penetrate. Concentrating it into destructive rays as hot as stars that can reduce a mountain range to dust or evaporate an ocean. Together with its crew of almost a hundred men. Professionals that are neither better nor worse than us. Well, I dare to say we're better trained, Astrogator. They are, however, unquestionable masters of propaganda. I know that some accomplishments they brag about are very much far-fetched. But the capabilities of the Invincible are not subject to doubt. And we as the scientific body should sever ourselves from the emotional and symbolic facade. In other words, we cannot ignore facts just because we don't like them, Mr. Cole. All right. But where do we stand in all this, together with our, may I say, not quite as numerous staff? Despite our modest forces, we still have a chance to gain a critical advantage over the Alliance while avoiding confrontation. Okay. And how would we do that? Simple. We leave this planet before the Invincible arrives here. Which is when, exactly? Well, they're still far away. Astrogator, please. How much time do we have to conduct safe research? Thirteen days. There's no time to lose, then. I appreciate your eagerness, Coble. Dr. Crowther, do we need full gear? Mm -hmm. Definitely. Also, I caution you against taking off your helmets for a prolonged duration. This amount of methane is not neutral. Breathing the local atmosphere will lead to saturation drop. And you may start showing symptoms of mild brain damage, feel stupefied. But uh, don't worry, not before an hour or even a couple of hours. I see. Dr. Gorski, will you program Artie to collect samples? Of course. Marit, Krauter, please prepare for the surface. Koval, you two. You're leaving early in the morning. And what about me? You're staying on board, Doctor. But Astrogator! Uh, this is not up for debate. I need you here. As ich bin da voll an Bord geblieben. Ich bin da voll an Bord geblieben. 
Well, if I was ordered to stay, what the hell am I doing here? <clears throat> oh, thank goodness. Not everyone's in the field. This is Dr. Yasna reporting. Do you copy? I'm entering the campgrounds. Is anyone out there? Oh, it's just an Androbot. Androbot. Stop. Androbot, stop. What the? Ah, Dr. Gorski, have you made changes to the Androbot's algorithms? without telling anyone again oh well never mind ja wo sind sie denn alle <lacht> oh hier ist einer hallo guten tag wie geht es sie oh dr crowter didn't you hear me earlier Doctor, is everything all right? Ein deutsches Kludi in Zug. <lacht> Was soll ich denn machen? Hallo? Genau so sieht das aus. <lacht> um. Doktor, please. Look at me. I report that I've located Dr. Crowter. He's in bad shape. I'm gonna examine him now. Temperature normal. Pulse 2. O2 saturation is fine. There's nothing physically wrong with the doctor. His pupils respond properly. Look at my finger. No delay in reactions. <laughs> Astrogator. Finally. I've been listening to you for two hours now. My receiver is dead. No need to explain yourself, Doctor. I know everything. The transmitter was still working, so I heard your reports. You didn't have it easy. Wait, please. I need to reconnect. <laughs> Testing. One, two, three. Ah, copy you, Doctor. Loud and clear. Do I understand correctly that the doctor's life is not in imminent danger? That's my initial diagnosis, yes. Yet no response to verbal communication? None. Conclusions, doctor? Up until yesterday, he wasn't suffering from any mental disorders. And there are no visible injuries. So, I test his blood for toxins. Could it be the methane from the atmosphere? No. Methane poisoning causes different symptoms. I'm afraid it's something else. I'll prepare the infirmary. But first things first, the lambda. We need to get you all on board. Couldn't we just evacuate him right away? If it were that easy, I would have sent the hopper long ago. Please look for the mission lock. It should include crucial data about the crew's activities. We have three more people to find. And you still need to designate a place for the landing. Hello? A 
anyone else here? I found Dr. Crowther. It's not a mission log, but it will do. Dr. Crowther kept records. Meticulous as always. What's in there? Eine erste Analyse der Proben ergab eine Zusammensetzung aus Nickel, Eisen, Mangan, Beryllium und Titan. Ich wüsste zu gern, was das ist. Ich tippe auf einen riesen, riesigen Meteor aus Nickel und Eisen, der vor Millionen von Jahren in die Atmosphäre von Regis 3 eingedrungen ist und alles zum Schmelzen gebracht hat. Nein, warte, vergiss es. Die Form der Strukturen spricht eine andere Sprache. Hm. Dr. Gorski has moved away from the research sector to the west. Ah, that's right. He followed those deposits of metal. The most important thing is probably the landing coordinates. BA 2316. Noting. 316. Excellent. I'm uploading the data. Starting calibration. Are you looking for the detector? Yeah, just a sec. Got it. Please make sure it works. I don't understand why it wouldn't. It's a rather reliable piece of equipment. Like everything around, it's already broken. Okay, checked. I'm leaving the tent. Unresponsive. Yes, I know. I'm currently trying to establish connection. Can I help somehow? You must look for the others, Doctor. I'll take care of this myself. Get the tin head back on its feet remotely. And secure Crowther. I have everything I need. Just... Is something wrong with the connection, sir? It's not working. I'm not sure why. There's a relay transmitter in the camp, so the signal should be strong enough. A relay? Hmm. Yasna, what are you up to? One sec. I'm looking for it. What about the rest of the crew? You're gonna make them wait? If the Androbot isn't working properly, I can't just leave Krauter like this. He might hurt himself. Uh, fine. Proceed as you deem fit. Wie heißt das Kopf? <coughs> Karun? <laughs> Fascinating. Did you find anything, Doctor? Nice specimen. Oh, and fish? It's still alive. Ah, the fish Dr. Gorski caught. Do you remember? Yeah, I remember. Something. Ooh. Dragonfly, come in. Uh, hello, Regis. Dragonfly here. Dr. Yasna at the radio. And Novik? Is his leg still bothering him? Yes. He's been resting in his quarters. We're setting up on a shore night. It's late, but we still have time to examine the ocean floor. Uh, Gorski is preparing the probe for launch. We'll start research soon. Oh, and um, one more thing, Yasna. Yes? It's beautiful here. The ocean... Wind, sand. My suit is pinching and cramping just at the mere sight. <laughs> <laughs> Should I include this in my reports? I'm serious. I don't know about you, but over the years I've learned to hate the voice. We do everything to go further, see more, take mankind one step closer to omnipotence, and then I can't even take a walk on land. As if Enjoying everything that's around us was almost a... I understand how you feel, Koval. After all these years, I miss home too. Is it that obvious? I come across as, well, erudite, but at the end of the day, it's simple longing that speaks through me. 
Well, a little obvious. Warum bewegt sich da einer so schnell? Und der eine ver bewegt sich ganz schnell weg. So, das ist die Sonde, oder was? Zurück. It's hard to speak of normality here, but animals are usually not afraid of equipment or, or anything they haven't seen before. Are you saying they've already seen probes? I've no idea, but their behavior suggests some sort of defense mechanism. I catch at least one for examination, then I'll be able to say more. I've got bad news. Our signal is far too weak to restart the Androbot. A relay malfunction? Not exactly. It's completely fried. I don't think a sandstorm could cause such damage. Well, that's irrelevant now, Doctor. There must be a spare somewhere in the camp. Please search for it. <sighs> no luck. Oh, they're not in here. Hallo, du Freund oder Feind? Das eine Zeit ist aber auch richtig schön zugeweht. Sind das für Geräusche? Das klang gerade ein bisschen wie ein Vogelgeschrei. Oder ist der das? the extra relay. Excellent. The signal should be back as soon as it's turned on. Sie haben safe den Fisch probiert, aber der lebt doch noch. Oh, I don't know if the Androbot should already be doing something. Is it still frozen? Yes, unfortunately. Hmm. A positronic brain has correct readings. 
Works. He moved. Finally. Artie should be walking now. Does he? His positional data hasn't changed. <laughs> well, you can see that he really wants to go, but still can't. Uh, please check his legs. Hmm. Could be the server motor. Ah, that's it. Got you, you tin bastard. Ah. Thank you, Doctor. I won't hold you any longer. Go find the others while I finish here. That's an order. Yes, sir. That's an order. No. Hmm. Wo soll ich sie denn finden? Keine Ahnung, wie ich sie gerade finden soll. Wenn du wüsstest, wo die sind, müsstest du nicht suchen. Wow, danke für deine Hilfe. point in going back this way. Ich weiß, wo sie sind. Irgendwo auf dem Planeten. Äh, Planeten. Planeten. Boah, voll am Spoilern hier, Wolfsflo. Wow. Wow. I should move. Oh, there's no time. I've gone over everything in that area. I recognize the rocks drawn by Krelta. They shouldn't pose a problem when landing. But the doctor marked a waypoint. I don't recall... It's, it's just a sketch. No markings. Well, if so, we should do it. What would you call them? Twins fits nicely. Affirmative. I'll write that down. I found the area marked by Dr. Krauter. There's no one around. What do you think? Can we land the hopper safely here? I think so. Solid ground. A large flat area. We won't find a better place. Entry point? Will it be 50 meters? Air accessibility is paramount. Yes, it's relatively clean. You can send Hopper, sir. Uh, 
Also, es stand da, dass ich spielen kann, bis sie aus dem Bunker wieder rauskommt, aber ich habe gar kein Gefühl. Ich wüsste gar nicht, was hier im Bunker sein soll. <lacht> Und ich bin einfach weiter. Komm schon nicht durch. Die Leute, jetzt ganz schön einsam da. Wieso? Wir haben doch den... Den, äh, den Captain, mit dem wir reden können. Und der Android wird wieder ganz. Und der Kraut hat da, der Prabbelzwar. Ja. Der Kraut hat, der Prabbel zwar ein bisschen komisch vor sich hin, aber das macht ja nichts. Der Fisch hört auch zu. Stimmt, der Fisch ist auch da. Gibt's das aber... Ja, ich bin sehr... Äh, oh, was ist da hinten? Oh, damn! I seem to have gone too far. I can see the field markings that Dr. Gorski left behind. And I haven't found anyone yet. They all may have left the area as well. But before you move on, make sure to check the whole perimeter. As long as I'm here, let's see if I can spot someone in the distance. Hm, right. Anything interesting? Hmm. Unfortunately, no. I'm going back. Nothing. Nothing. Status? Nothing's changed, Astrocator. Understood. Das sieht ja crazy aus, ja? I'm entering the research area. Clear for now. Tracker? Silent. By the way, what did they find here? Oh, right. You don't remember. A piece of metal sticking out of the ground. Sounds inconspicuous, but in this desert environment, it's a phenomenon. The artifact turned out to be too big to dig up, or to subject to chemical and spectrometric analysis. Dr. Gorski set out to investigate its source, to find some end. And? Did he? That, I don't know, unfortunately. It's here. I can see the structure. I'm in the right place. Understood. Please continue. Da kam gerade ein komisches Geräusch. Huh. Something on the ground. It's a journal. 
Ooh. Geological cross-section measurements. These are Merritt's notes. Oh, she must be somewhere close. Please search the entire area thoroughly. Warte, ich wollte es lesen. Warte mal. Lass mal das andere nochmal lesen. Wir müssen uns auf beides konzentrieren. Untersuchungen der Wasserchemie und geologische Bohrungen. <lacht> Sea Life stand da, Fragezeichen. Lehmablagerungen durchsetzt mit einer schwarz-roten Substanz weder geologischen noch planetarischen Ursprungs. Millionen von Jahre alt, mindestens. Okay, da ist hier das Metallgebilde. <lacht> Kosmosolidarische Allianz, Hauptsitz des interplanetarischen Commonwealth, ha äh, Raumfahrtabteilung, Sonnensystem. Sehr geehrter Dr. Marit, ist das nicht nur Sie gewesen? Als Resultat der letzten interplanetarischen Konferenz möchten wir Sie hier für die anstehende Expedition Obelisco 3 zum Astrogator ernennen. Ihre Fähigkeiten und Leistungen in früheren Missionen haben gezeigt, dass Sie für die nächste Phase der Erkundung des Weltalls bereit sind. Wir würden uns über eine Antwort freuen, sobald Sie von Ihrer aktuellen Mission zurückgekehrt sind. Mit freundlichen Grüßen, General Birksart, Befehlshabender Offizier Raumfahrtabteilung. So, so. I think I know where I can find her. Was die Frage, wie komme ich jetzt da hoch? Folge dem Aufspürer, ja, da laufe ich in die Wand. <lacht> Hat jemand von euch das Buch gelesen? Oh, nur der Ruck sagt, na, das... Das Nur den Autor. Ah. Oh, Marit, Marit. Draufhaut. Oder eine Träne. Eine Träne hilft auch immer. Macht das, Krasi. Everything will be fine. Tja, woran ist sie gestorben, ne? Ja, das ist jetzt der ihr Tracker. Okay. 
do you think? Call them. Yeah, we'll hear. You'll find it, Doctor. Alive. I'm sure about that. Someone's here. Gabe Danaro war raus? Ja, ich hab's gesucht. <lacht> Weißt du, da muss ich nicht hin, aber ich will gucken. Hier ist ein Geis heißt das Geysir? Ja, ne? Hui! Da. Oh, nö. Was ist denn mit dem? Ist er baden gegangen? Oh, no. Hallo? 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 Parameters normal, yet he's completely unresponsive. Der brabbelt jetzt auch so, oder was? Kovel. Hello. Kovel. Oh. His eyes are so empty. Just like Crouch's. Kovel, what the hell is wrong with you? Are all the symptoms the same as Dr. Crouch's? He's calm. Calmer. Well, at least he's alive. Now listen to me, Yasna. The lander is on its way, but before you get Dr. Cobble on board, I want you to do something. Yasna. I'm listening. Please look around for his journal. It's everywhere. In pieces. Alec Gaga. <sighs> Not good. Cobble was in radio contact with Dr. Gorski. Taking notes. That's exactly why it's so important. These notes may help us find our man. I'll go over them, but it may take a while. Huh. Have you found it? No, it's uh, nothing about Dr. Gorski. Da stand das Leben auf dem Planeten und Jasna wird sich äh, sehr freuen darüber. Ah, found them. Surprisingly accurate. He wrote down Gorski's every step. Great. Guck mal, jetzt muss ich in die Base rein. Can you carry him, Doctor? <laughs> Won't be pretty hard in 1G. But the gravity here should make things a tad easier. Die Strukturen verzweigen sich im Untergrund. Äh, geh überprüft den rechten Ausläufer. Zweitens riesige vertikale Struktur. Sie ragt über die Oberfläche. Drittens Wassertank. Unterirdische Strukturen. Viertens die bislang größte. 150 Meter im Berg markiert. Fünftens, von Punkt 4 aus sichtbar. Azimut 350, Entfernung 200. Oh Gott, das muss ich dann finden, oder was? So, ich habe mir nur Dezen gemacht. Und ich trage jetzt den Typen, oder was? Bin eine starke, selbstbewusste und unabhängige Jasna? Ich werde den ja wohl wegbekommen, ne? The land is already descending. Cobble, look over there. You'll be on track in a moment. Safe and sound. Well, safe. Did he react? Not at all. Einer fehlt aber noch, oder? 
It all has to be related somehow. On the other hand, how could it be? There's not much on this planet. Primitive life forms in the ocean, metal deposits in the ground. Although the latter got Dr. Gorski's interest for some reason. Nothing adds up. But I'm afraid it's our own fault. It was going so well before. We hadn't even considered the possibility of failure. Started digging right away. Taking samples. Not even trying to avoid potential threats. Kovel was alone. Out of the signal's reach. Dr. Gorski wandered even further away. On his own. And Merit... She... Yes, now? You there? Yeah, sorry. I lost track of my thoughts. Don't even know what I wanted to say anymore. Oh, that happens to all of us. Don't worry. Hallo, Roko Lan, hallo, Nida. Ja, ist ja auch noch nicht geklärt, wieso ich rausgegangen bin, ne? Ach, der ist auch schon hier drin. Ach so, der Android hat den da reingesteckt. See you up there. Only Gorski's left. He might have made it quite far. Agreed. Everything points to it. I don't know how long I'll be looking for him. It might take hours before I come back. We also don't know Gorski's condition, nor what he's going through. I'll go back for Marit's body first. Take her to the lander. But yes, sir. Dr. Marit is already gone. What if we also lose Gorski? I've made up my mind, Astrogator. I can't leave her like this. Mensch, die jetzt wieder finde. Wo war die denn? <lacht> Wo war die? Ich glaube geradeaus einfach, ne? Ey, pass auf, die Leiste ist jetzt bestimmt weg. Das wäre typisch. Das wäre so typisch, wenn die jetzt weg... Nee, sie ist noch da. Status? What's new? Well, nothing, really. At least not in the last five seconds, sir. Huh? Right. Thank you. Yes, sir. Come in. How are you feeling? How do you think, sir? I'm managing. Somehow. Forgive me, but I need to know if you're ready to continue your mission. <sighs> ready? Well... I don't think we have much choice in the matter. There's only one way forward. Was is it dahin or dahin? Dahin, I have served with Dr. Marit for over two decades. She's made of sterner stuff. The sternest. Many of us relied on her. I did. Did you know that headquarters offered her a promotion? She would have been the first female astrogator in the history of the Commonwealth. I had no idea. Doesn't matter anymore, really. Not entirely. Marit will be awarded posthumously. Toy. I'm taking you at your word, astrogator. This could pave the way for others. And that's what she would have cared about the most. No doubt about it. Bestimmt nur ein Traum. Ich habe gestern den Film äh, Silber geguckt. Oder Silber. Ich glaube, es ist ein deutscher Film sogar gewesen. Der war auch ganz cool, muss ich sagen. Ich dachte erst, das ist so ein übelster Teenie-Film. 
Teenie-Film, so. Für... Aber... Der war echt spannend. Das ist bestimmt super, mit so einer Toten da drin zu sitzen. Aber ich glaube, den Zweien ist das eh egal. Please take good care of her. Of course. Dr. Gorsk is next. Let's hope he got out of danger in time. It would be good to know what kind of danger we're talking about. Hmm. So, Folge seiner Spur. Da müssen wir jetzt nochmal in die Notizen gucken. Okay, ich muss links lang anscheinend. Also zumindest steht da Gorski. Ups. Aber da war doch die Flagge, oder? Da hieß es doch eigentlich, dass das zu weit ist. Ich vermute, dass der... Eckt das gerade ein bisschen? Ich vermute, dass der runtergegangen ist. Yes, sir. Everything's all right? Yes. Yes. I just need a moment to think. Uh, as soon as you find something... I'll report it. No worries, sir. I'm leaving the excavation site. <sighs> How did he come down? Bist du nix? mir das eine oder leckt das jetzt ein bisschen? Da ist die Sonne. Was haben die gesagt? Die Sonne hatte auch schon bessere Zeiten gesehen. Und es ist fast schon ein roter Zwerg. Dann who? Uh, not who, but what. What? Weird. Dr. Gorski hardly ever parted with it. With what? Ah, you're talking about the teleprobe. Uh, yes. Ah, uh, yeah. I located the probe. It's lying on the ground, inactive. Can't be completely broken if you picked up a signal. I'd say it's running in safe mode. Please try to power it on. Do we have time for this? It's for a good reason, Doctor. The probe could prove useful in the search. And besides... You'll see. Okay. I'm opening the probe. Turning the systems on. No, no, stop. Wait for my instructions. There's a button on the left side of the fuse box. Hold it and then turn the dial again. Now go okay. ahead. That's all. Slide records. Correct. I, I didn't know we had access to them. You couldn't have known. This is not standard procedure. But as they say, extremis malice, extrema remedia. Ja, das sag ich auch immer. Let's take a look. <lacht> das sind die Fotos. <lacht> Sehr süß. <lacht> das sind die Fische. Oh, nothing interesting. Should I be looking for a specific location? Date. The excavation site. Fourth day of the mission. I recognize these structures. 
This is where they began to dig. Twelve hours passed. Three crew members are still there. Dr. Gorski must have left already. We lost contact shortly thereafter. The probe followed him, and he followed the detector's readings. Going after those metal structures. Yes, that's what I meant. What's next? Last slide. There's mostly noise. Nothing in particular stands out to you, Doctor. They were digging and suddenly, poof, people are dead. No need to shout, Astrogator. I'm just letting you know what I see. That's all. Uh, hang on. An absurdly high electromagnetic field reading. That's something. Sort of. What are the earlier readings? Checking. Still high in the slide just before. And earlier, quite normal. Was ist das mal? Was ist das mal? Was ist das mal? It happened in a matter of seconds. But there's there's nothing except dunes. Sand, a few rocks, a shadow. Shadow. Another sandstorm, I guess. All right, Doctor. Let's move on. You may turn on the fuses now. We'll take the probe with us. Good. I've got it on my radar. Now I can give commands to the probe. And? What do you see? Me, what do you Is see? Is it working correctly? It's not flying very smoothly. I guess it's still a bit broken. Meaning? How? What do you got to do with the line? Just up and down, then sideways. No complex moves. Ah, don't worry about that. It's because I'm controlling it manually. I'll put it in auto mode. From now on, it will follow you, Doctor. Also dafür, dass der. Oh, be nice to have some company. I mean, apart from yours, sir. One second. Oh, that's odd. There's no data in the probe's memory. No ID, no nothing. If you want to give it a new ID, name it, basically. After all, it'll be with you for a while. So, what's it going to be? Huh. A name for the teleprobe. All right. I can think of something. Copy that. I'm listening. Das ist eine Biene, na klar. Please enter B. <lacht> B E E. Da. Natürlich. Now, a few more tweaks and you'll have a flying measurement center at your disposal. So. Kann man noch Dr. Gorski finden? Bin eine Biene. Ja, das war doch, also, wenn die einem Biene vorschlagen, Tja, und jetzt? Ja, das ist die Drohne, die ist ja... Wohin? Wahrscheinlich da runter. Irgendwie. Aber wie? Oh, 
This mission drags on so much. Sometimes I think you're gonna take off without me, sir. <laughs> don't count on it, Doctor. I don't see these metal structures anywhere. The only surface structure reported was from the excavation area. The rest is underground. Please explore the area thoroughly. Just do as Dr. Gorski. Use the detector. The detector's measurement is very clear. I'm going straight on. No crossroads? Branches? Not yet. Just one thick, tangled vein. Da sind doch welche. I guess I found the first point. You guess? We have to be sure, Doctor. Well, I'm at the first clear branching of these structures, such as reported by Dr. Gorski. All right. What happened next? Next come. He followed the branch to the right. Nach rechts. Okay. The probe detected something. I see that in the readings. What is it exactly? Well, the structure from the notes, it fits the description perfectly. Well done, B. I knew I could count on you. Well, we didn't bring it to the surface for no reason. Even in the first stage procedure. Hello, B. Wassertank. Zeigt über die Wasser unterirdische Strukturen. Ich denke, wie finde ich jetzt den Wassertank? Feel really heavy. Give yourself a moment to rest, Doctor. You certainly deserve it. Ich finde das voll süß, wie die. Du musst so was ich so und Ah, das hier sieht wie Wasser aus. Water was mentioned in the note. Around the third point. And I have a matching object here. All right. So how many are left? Two points. Or at least that's what he told Kovel. What he did next? It's hard to assess. Well, the battery and the detector last for only a few hours. So he couldn't have gone much further. Hm. 
The fourth point is a structure that fills a rock massive, on top of which he found surface structures. Uh, sounds like a crucial node in this whole system. Meter im Berg markiert. Das heißt, er hat dort eine Flagge hingesetzt oder was? 150 Meter im Berg. Ist jetzt hier durch das Wasser durchlaufen oder was? Oder ich hätte wahrscheinlich auch hier lau lang laufen können. Ein Stück weit, Jasna. Ein Stück weit. Hallo, Ragnetasch. Fußabdrücke. Gotcha. I found his tracks. Finally, some tangible evidence that he was going this way. Ah, good. Downhill all the way, Doctor. I wouldn't be so sure, Astrogator. The next point is at a height of approximately 100 meters. Definitely uphill. What if I don't find him at all? You will. Just follow his tracks, Ken. According to our records, it's been no more than six hours since he was here. Think about it, Doctor. On a cosmic scale, it's nothing. Well, on a human scale, it could mean the difference between life and death. I think we have the fourth point. Ach so? Was denn? Ach, da oben. Ah, ja. I confirm. It's the fourth one. I see our flag. Dann ist er ja da hochgeklettert. Eieiei, da soll ich auch hin? Or we or what? Da soll ich auch hin. Okay, gar kein Problem. Von Punkt 4 aus sichtbar. Also muss ich da hoch. Okay. Super. Gar kein Problem, glaube ich. seems to be slipping through my fingers like sand. So much sand. You sound tired, Jasna. <laughs> Because I am tired, Astrogator. Eh, ich hänge fest. Kann ich überhaupt langlaufen? Muss ich überhaupt lang? I don't know. zu Lana. Wieso funzelt denn der mich ständig ins Gesicht? Der hat ja gesagt, der tut die manuell steuern. Tja, da muss ich hoch. Natürlich, Lüda. Was hast du denn gedacht? Ah, whilst traversing this planet, I'm becoming more and more convinced that what I know is 
Not the same as what exists. What can exist. I must admit it's an interesting thought. But quite disturbing. Gehst du da runter? Na, wir werden... Wir sind bisher immer dorthin gekommen, wo wir hin sollten. Das werden wir bestimmt jetzt auch schaffen. Three, two, one. So. The land is departing. Yes, they're on their way. Thank you for your assistance. Without your help, it would have taken much longer. What's the plan for the second flight? The same place? That would work best. Certain, proven. When you and Dr. Gorski come back, I'll send the lander right away. Und so gleich kommt eine riesige Krabbe. Oh. Also ich glaube, hier ist das Gebilde, oder? Das sind die Zwillinge da hinten. Ah. I've reached the top. The doctor discovered something new from here. Something he called bushes. Huh. I've heard that term before. In their conversations? Between Kovel and Gorski? No, Jasna. You're the one who reported it to me. Right after you landed. Seriously? Well, I... I... I don't see anything like it now, sir. Wait. Is that zweite Flug? Yeah. Kovel noted down the parameters. Azimuth 350. A distance 200 meters. Copy that. I'm sending the probe. Hat er die Biene jetzt eingeschickt? Bewegen sich. Got it. I see the bushes. And the doctor? Hmm, hard to tell. Visibility is poor. Huh. It's going to be harder than before. I don't know how the doctor. <sighs> When it comes to finding a safe route, there won't be a problem. But you'll have to get there on your own two feet. I suppose the probe will carry out the first task. It's capable yet? Of course. I set the environment analysis mode. The probe will calculate the best route between your location and your destination. It'll guide you along the defined path. The calculations will only take a moment. Also, ich muss jetzt dahinter. Warte mal, da war der Vulkan. Okay, da bin ich da gerade hergekommen. Na lol. Okay, dann laufen wir wieder das Stück zurück. Gar kein Problem, spring! Ja, was soll schon passieren? Ah, danke! Nee, das geht nicht. <lacht> Hi, B. Lead the way. Bist du schnell? I must say, it's a clever device, this probe of ours. They could have fly for this long. Yes. Longer than you can stand on your feet. Sounds like the perfect research unit. Maybe even better than a human. Well, let's not exaggerate. Of course, I wasn't being serious. However helpful they may be, they're still just tools in the hand of man. Often faulty. Das bin ja vorwärts marsch! <lacht> Oder so. Diese Büsche sahen aus wie Seeigel. Nicht, dass die mich pieksen wollen. Oh. We have a problem. Something serious? I already mentioned the faulty machines, right? Well, the route determined by the algorithm goes over a chasm. 
I can repeat the command. No, no. I'll go around. Uh, unfortunately, this is an outdated model. Such mistakes are inevitable. But the perception module itself has already been greatly improved. Its accuracy increases exponentially. Exponentially? <laughs> can you imagine us, proteinaceous creatures, developing so quickly, sir? No. Not in the course of evolution. You can't perfect a person like that. That's right. You can't. We wait thousands of years for visible changes. Oh, have you started to fear for your position? <laughs> Maybe they can be improved rapidly, but these are only selected modules. Algorithms. There's still a long way to go to develop an artificial brain that would even slightly reflect the complexity of the human one. Yes, we probably won't live to see that. Probably not. Besides, Gib mir genauso, no intelligent machine would take this job. Shh, Astrogator, can you hear that? Uh, what am I supposed to be hearing? That's the point. Nothing. Silence. We're talking about robots, and Dr. Gorski still hasn't spoken on the channel. Hmm. Well, I don't know. He must be a long way from here. Es war heute auch nur einkaufen, weil ich Nachtcreme brauchte, Kakao und was für die Mädels heute Abend. Sonst hätte ich es nicht eingekauft. Und da ist halt leider wieder Sushi und Kimchi in meinem Warenkorb gelandet. Sorry. I have a feeling we're in the dark. We have to find a way. Agreed. You should move on. Uh, that's not quite what I meant. But yeah, I probably should. Da sind die Büsche. Jetzt bin ich schon mal gespannt, was das ist. Auf jeden Fall flimmert so komisch davon weg. Es würden die irgendwelche Sporen aus absenden these bushes are kind of weird you better stay away doctor i'd like a brief description just keep a distance allow me to use a language i would use to describe living forms sir of course so they look like pituitary brush-like formations they grow out of cracks in the bare rock they can be singular though in some locations they create a uniform thicket that covers the walls of the ravine in a rusty brush-like layer. They're high, more or less, from one to several meters. That's how it looks, to put it briefly. Would you also venture to guess their significance? Some function, purpose? Staying on the topic of biological analogies, these bushes remind me of corals in a purely visual category because they're far from marine organisms. So I would guess that these are colonial structures, perhaps rock forming ones. However, their main structure has nothing to do with corals. No noticeable mesenchymal tissues, no nidocyst, matocyst, or spirocyst, no visible oral discs. All right, all right, Doctor. I didn't ask for a marine biology lecture. Warum denn nicht? So nu? Lauf ich einfach weiter. Astrogator, Gorski is not here. I'm afraid he continued to explore. And if he went where I think he did, he might have lost contact with the camp as well as Dragonfly. Uh, so we will most likely lose contact. Uh, possibly. Well, there's only one way to be certain. 
It's your decision, sir. Please continue your search. We have to find him. You may lose another crew member. <laughs> if you think so, turn back now. Uh, no, I won't. I can't leave him. It's just... I'm concerned. It's understandable. Oh, die Musik wird schon etwas um, bedrohlicher. The line's breaking up, but I understood. I'll let you know, sir, when I come out of the tunnel. Aber soll ich jetzt hier durch die Pflanzen durchlaufen? Es wird ein Schreck sauern. Ich finde es voll spannend. Das war, als er mich dann alleine hinterher geschickt hat. Hopper has landed. I repeat, Hopper has landed. Astrogator, can you hear me? Loud and clear. Any side effects? Landing wasn't too hard on you? All good. Spine still in one piece. That's... No signs of overstrain. Not even shortness of breath. Perfect. Hopefully the hike to camp goes just as smoothly. So klar, is... wo ist denn hier die Tür? Hallo Tür? Doch hier. Achso, die geht automatisch auf. Okay. I'm going outside. Visibility? 100%. The dust has already settled. Huh. I've located the second lander. Our people are still on this planet. Ah, very good. I was afraid they might try to fly off. Sir, something's wrong. What is it? The hatch is half open. Did they report hydraulics failure? How should I know? You were the last person in contact with the crew, Doctor. Right. I'm inside. And? How is it? Even if they wanted to, they couldn't go back to Dragonfly. Their lander looks damaged, to put it mildly. Or more accurately, it, it seems like a storm has passed through it. Understood. I mean, I don't understand how it happened. But that means... Hopper is the only vehicle that can take us home. <clears throat> Affirmative. Right. But then we can't afford another mistake. I'm taking the lander into orbit. I'll send it directly to the camp as soon as we find a suitable landing zone. Astrogator, I think... I don't know what we expected. Coming here at the end of our expedition. The equipment is barely working. If it works at all. And you, sir. You barely escaped alive. Okay, I admit that we have a very successful campaign behind us. But I feel like we've used up all our luck. And now, we're asking for trouble. It's just one planet too many for us. Which doesn't change the fact we're here. Let's focus on completing this mission. There won't be another. It better be that way. We have the right to come home at last. I'm afraid I'm unfamiliar with such a law. But there is one thing I can refer to when we find ourselves in a difficult situation. If the continuation of the mission endangers the lives of the crew, the provisions of the imprimis homini law apply. First and foremost, the safety of people is what matters. Ranis Games, thank you for your Prime Sub. Herzlich willkommen im Catfight Club. Vielen, vielen Dank. Hallo, Phoebe. It's good to know we have this right, but I wish we didn't have to use it. Ich 
muss ja gar nichts mehr angucken, oder? Ein bisschen vor wie bei Phasmophobia <lacht> mit dem Suchen und den Geräten. When you admire a beautiful view, an hour seems like a minute. But a minute mm. on a hot stove will seem longer than an hour. Does Regis 3 feel like a hot stove? Sometimes. Das sieht aber schön aus. Weil wie nah ist... Hä? Verstehe ich gar nicht. Ich verstehe den Blick gar nicht. Wie kann denn der Planet dort zu sehen? Also, hä? Wie, wie geht oh. das? Damn. You were right, Cobble. It's beautiful here. Vielleicht wirkt die Atmosphäre wie eine Lupe. Aber mit, mit auch diese Schleier und so. Schöner Strand, auf jeden Fall. Man hat nur das Gefühl, dass wenn man zu weit rausschwimmt, dass man hinten vom Planeten runterfällt. <lacht> Weil ich meine... Äh? <lacht> Musste aufpassen. I heard that the difference between past, present and future is nothing but a persistent illusion. That's a quote, right? Yeah. I'm not sure why it came to mind. I have an object in sight. Ach, das ist. Kann ich das jetzt benutzen? Ach so, nee. This is where they searched the ocean's biosynosis. Meaning. Oh, where they call that fish, right? Mm, yeah. They stopped here first, then walked along the coastline northward. Correct. But I think you might consider taking a shortcut towards the east, straight to the camp. Da sind noch die Fußabdrücke. Noch Fußabdrücke, ja. Kann ich nicht einfach das Seil benutzen? Kann ich mal hier dran. Da Hä? Gut, dann eben nicht. Ja, das wurde schon benutzt. Das ist ein Einmalseil. Ach so. Are there any signs of the crew? I found a cigarette butt and a pack. Someone was smoking here. Ah. So, they didn't give a damn about the regulations. Das ist sehr frech. Ecosystem. That's not the point. 
I understand you want to minimize the effects of our interference here, Doctor, but the mission's safety is at stake. I don't think I have to explain to you the dangers of igniting a dusty atmosphere. Preserving the integrity of Regis 3's already extinct ecosystem is not a priority in this scenario. Negligible. Nein, isn't this? Security procedures exist for humans. Hello, Pelarius. The rule of integrity is for the sake of everything alien to us. We shouldn't place one above the other. What are you saying, Yasna? The mission and the safety of our people have the highest priority. Always. Das ist ja wieder typisch, Mensch. <laughs> Always? Are we really that self-righteous? Of course, Doctor. We must be the most important to ourselves. And they must be the most important to themselves. Whoever they will be. In the end, the strongest will survive. Isn't that how evolution works? Not in a biological sense, Astrogator. Besides, I'm not convinced if we should interfere with everything alien to us just because we can. Doctor, interference is at the heart of human nature. Man would still be a monkey if he'd only looked at trees instead of cutting them down. Yeah, wäre vielleicht besser gewesen. We have a nasty nature. I can't argue with that. Was typisch Mensch ist, ja, dass er sich selber am wichtigsten ist und die Natur egal. Ja, Mensch, wie soll ich denn... Wo, wo soll ich denn hin, hä? In einer Stunde? Folge dem Aufspürer 2000. Du schon wieder. Ich glaube, das wird nichts mehr, Toni. Das machen wir morgen. Ja, aber meine Mädels kommen doch 20 Uhr. Ich bin, glaube ich, im Kreis gelaufen, oder? <lacht> Lull. Ähm, ähm. Ich bin im Kreis gelaufen. Cool, oder? Wie <lacht> komme ich denn hier runter? Ähm, nun. Hat er nicht gerade meine Route bestätigt? Es soll doch... Es soll doch dahin, oder? Zum Lageplatz. Oder wie, oder was? Wir gehen weiter in Richtung des Lagers. Lageplatz, oder... Oder Lager? Nee, zum Camp soll ich... Ach so, okay, ich soll gar nicht zu dem Platz da unten. Ich soll zum Camp... <lacht> Ja, ich hab's jetzt auch I'm gemerkt. Here, if you're sir. <lacht> Bin süß, oder? Hallo, Takes longer than expected. I know the situation. No need to explain yourself, Doctor. We're in this together. Ich hab ihn falsch verstanden. Ich dachte, ich soll hier schon gucken, wo die sind, aber. Die gehen davon aus, dass sie im Lager sind. Chanette, hallo. Dankeschön. I see you. Bist du auf dem richtigen Weg? 
Ne, das ist doch auch schon wieder der falsche Weg. Und wo komme ich denn hier hin? Da komme ich wahrscheinlich gar nicht weiter. Hallo. Academy, they used to say that difficult routes lead us the farthest. Well, hopefully not too far. You still have to come back. Are you trying to motivate me, sir? Of course. I appreciate the uh, effort. Wir hätten hier führen die Wege bestimmt zusammen, oder? Ja, guck, easy. <lacht> Gar kein Problem. Ja. Da oben sind auch wieder die Büsche. Ah, das ist der Bericht, von dem da vorhin geredet hat. Da habe ich auch schon die Büsche gesehen. It looks like some spiky metal growths. Artificial plants? Is spontaneous growth possible with this type of structure? Oh, I've never seen anything like this. I wish I had time to run some tests. When the situation is stabilized, we will take samples. I promise. Wieso? Nein, sie hat das Giftezap, was du ihr geschenkt hast, hat sie verlängert. Aufpassen wegen Pollenallergie. Ja. Das finde ich immer so extrem, wenn du so einen Herzschlag hörst. Oh. <lacht> nee, alles gut, Krasi. Ah, okay, jetzt sind wir wieder in der Gegenwart. Warum immer etwas überfordert. Fragt Miss Ma. <lacht> Was habe ich gerade gesehen? Da war gerade. What, what's this? Warum? Warum? Ah, hier. Oh Mann! Hä? Sie verschwindet ein bisschen in der Feststruktur hier. Da. Are you there? Over. I guess that's a no. I'm back. Is everything all right? Yes. Yes, all good. They're already in the infirmary on life support. You found them in time. Jasna hat Krauter gerettet. Jawohl. How about their reactions? Have they regained consciousness? I mean, maybe one of them said something. Uh, unfortunately, they're still unresponsive. I'll let you know if anything changes. I'm doing an EEG on them right now.
Guess I know where Gorska was going. Weißt du auch, wie er da hingekommen ist? I ah. confirm, Gorski was here. His rope is still hanging from the slope. That's a good sign. Since he left it, he intends to come back this way. But why hasn't he yet? I'm going down after him. Tell me one more thing. When it comes to Marit, are you going to use a grave tapper? Yes, I'm considering that as a possibility. And what is your opinion? Should we look into it? Oh, es konnte nicht mehr antworten. One sec. How about the end of the rope? Isn't that good? Not at all. What do you mean? The last thing I need. Oh, I'm stuck. I'm hanging with my full weight on the rope, away from the wall. Oh, I can't go up. Nothing to grab onto. Doch die Drohne. <lacht> Komm her. Vielleicht hat die, vielleicht hat die Merit, weil die geraucht hat. Äh, irgendwie. I can't reach the wall. How far to the ground? A good few meters. Aber da sind Fußspuren. Any ideas? Der der Garski oder wie der heißt der hat's ja auch geschafft. Is that safe? I think it is. You think? You shouldn't base your safety on assumptions. Do I have another choice? I can't grow wings, can I? Are you having a hard time keeping your position? I'm hanging limp. All right, let's take a moment to think it through. I'm thinking if Gorski went down this way and didn't break anything. Yeah, we don't know that, Yasna. You could keep going even with injuries. Man stirbt nur einmal. All right. So, do you have another idea? Oh, will I be hanging like this until the end of time itself? There is a certain possibility, or rather uncertain, but maybe it's worth trying. I'm listening. Can you see the probe? Yes. It's flying near me. If I instructed it to fly as close as possible to you, you could grab onto it. Are you sure it will hold me? That I cannot guarantee. All right, let's give it a try. I'm entering the instruction. You must guide me. Eventually, sind wir gleich. One meter forward. I can't reach it. Sind wir gleich unsere Biene los? A bit closer, please. Is the maneuver complete? You could say so. I fell from a lower height. It was a soft landing, though. Ja, war doch... Nein! Alles gut, Biene. Alles gut! <lacht> Alles gut, wir sind angekommen. Und hier sind die Fußspuren. Ja, 
had our last contact with Regis a few minutes after noon. Even then, Dr. Gorski was walking alone. Damn. This place is amazing. It's all made up of these structures. Except they don't look like creations of nature anymore. Uh, maybe that's why Dr. Gorski, not to mention the Alliance. Well, if we're looking for something on this planet, this could be it. These structures form entire multi-story complexes. They look like a city. Are you saying that... No, no. There's no point in jumping to conclusions yet. Boah, hab ich schon gerade die Fahne gesehen. Ach da. Left or right? Dr. Gorski set up the flags. Sir, he kept going, despite the lack of communication with the rest. You'd have to see it with your own eyes, sir. This place. Gorski may have lost himself in his discovery. Are you joking, Doctor? Lost him? Are you receiving a signal? What signal? From Dr. Gorski. No, no. Why are you asking? He tried to open up a connection, set up a transmitter. There's nothing on the comms, but I'll check the record history. Please give me a moment. Tja, links oder rechts rum? Blockierter Weg, Spalt. Alright. I'll squeeze through the passage. Gorski has left of oxygen, at best. And at worst? He's just finishing it up. Though it all depends on his activity. If I remember correctly, the atmosphere here is breathable. Basically, yes. Dr. Crowther, however, warned that the methane content... I know, I know. But the effects won't be immediate. That gives us a few extra hours. These constructions don't have a clear division into functions. They're huge, complicated, and uniform at the same time. Do you have any idea where all this could have come from? I'm aware without tests you can't do much. But let's say on first inspection. If metamorphism and other natural factors are to be excluded, there is only one conclusion. Someone or something must have put them here. But who? The Alliance? Because you don't need to say... Oh, I do. I suspect the surface of Regis III was once inhabited. Um, I can't tell if any of this could be part of a machine. Really wish we found Gorski already. Und dann muss ich den ja doch zurückbringen. Oh, I've already been there. Wie, das war es bereits. Ich bin doch von da drüben gekommen, oder? Ich habe doch jetzt den blockierten Weg ja, äh, umgangen. How's the terrain? Those structures, are they still everywhere? Yep, wherever I look, there's metal. Ah, I see the probe. Has it found anything? It's not making any measurements at the moment. Oh, why? The overload protection is activated. Until I do a reset, it's on manual control. Mm. Oh, is it because of my flight? It's possible, but please don't worry about it. What matters is that you're fine. 
So, wir, ko wir kommen müssen jetzt da hoch. Ist aber, wenn es mal eine Stadt war, sieht es aber komisch aus, oder? It's a bit like Pando. Ich weiß es auch nicht. A, a colony ah. of populist tremoloids. American Aspen. The new trees grow not from seeds, but from root suckers of old trees. As a result, it's one giant organism, thousands of years old. So you're in a dead metal forest. Huh, that does sound bizarre. So maybe. Hm. Na gut, das dort oben könnte wie Räume aussehen, aber weil das halt alles wie so Rohre sind. Seltsame Gegend, hä? Wer weiß, wie es auf anderen Planeten aussieht, ne? Doktor, something has been recorded after all. But there are plenty of errors in the transmission header. It's hard to say whether this is a message from Gorski. Well, but sir, play it. Maybe we'll finally find out what's going on with the Doctor. Let's hope so. Gorski to base. I repeat, this is Gorski. Base, come in. No doubt, it's him. Let's keep listening. But as soon as you report anything, Doctor, I'll stop the recording. God, bugger. No confirmation again. I report. I've made an amazing discovery. Geometric structures that a thicket of bushy, pointed rods and slats. Mostly iron. But not only, molybdenum, carbon, tungsten, altogether similar to a giant integrated circuit. A million swarm of tangled cables. Not a trace of electric currents, polarity, not even residual magnetism. Maybe once upon a time, centuries ago, petawatts or exawatts of power flowed this way. You know, to compare with something, it's, it's probably a machine. Some kind of information collective structure. Maybe it was some kind of electronic brain. It makes me think of the Lyrans. A race of experience. Was sind Supposedly, they knew about light astrogation before we invented the wheel. They had to save themselves from the explosion of Nova. They sent ships. The remains of the remains of those ships have been found ash to a chip glued together. I've seen hypothetical schematics. The structures here remind me of those. Okay. Moving on. Readings. Well, that's it. What follows is just a humming noise. Any thoughts, Doctor? Well, so far, it all leads to one conclusion. This is not a place for a man. <laughs> nor for any humanoids. Then, who is it for? For machines. Maybe it's really an alien technology. Those Lyrans. Uh, as far as I know, all information about the Lyran civilization is just guesswork. Many consider Lyrans to be just a myth, so I wouldn't take it too seriously. Well, I think there might be something to it. By the way, you were right, Doctor. Gorski did lose himself in this discovery, in spite of everything. Sind wir da in einem riesigen, in einer riesigen künstlichen Intelligenz drin, vielleicht? Ich muss erstmal zu der Flagge. I can see the relay up close. Looks broken. Such damage could be caused by a local meteorological phenomenon. A severe thunderstorm with litho and electrometeors. So, the weather is to blame for all of it. Klar, well, immer. I can't think of a better explanation at the moment. 
Vielleicht liegst du mit angeschlagenem Kopf irgendwo und träumst das bestimmt. Koski! Wo bist du? Ich glaube, da kann ich auch lang. Oh, ich kann mich nicht entscheiden. Entweder ich laufe jetzt hier lang und dann da hinten runter. That's where I came from. Why now? Ach so, okay. Ne, dann... Wenn die jetzt sagt, da bin ich hergekommen, dann gehen wir in die andere Richtung. Gleich ist es zu Ende. Fahrradunfall. <lacht> ja, wie gesagt, ich darf das Spiel eigentlich on stream nur bis zu einem bestimmten Punkt spielen. Und da stand irgendwas von, wenn ich wieder an die Oberfläche komme. Also ich denke, da sind wir noch nicht. <lacht> Hoffe ich, dass wir das so nicht gemacht haben. <lacht> Aber wir waren da bis auf jetzt noch nicht wirklich unterirdisch unterwegs. Oh, hier liegt auch was. Fußabdrücke. There are more traces. This time handprints and a drop detector. Stimmt. Did I hear you right? Yes, sir. You heard me right. As if he fell and then crawled on all fours. Bloodstains? No. Luckily nothing like that. Jetzt wird's labyrinthisch. Ah, hier sind nochmal Fußspuren, okay. No one of sound mind would decide to go down this way. And yet Gorski. I found something. Again. I'm listening. Uh, more of the same stuff. Gorski's things. More traces. Fine. Actions devoid of logic. Back in the camp, you reported Marit's abandoned things. A backpack and a journal, yes. And this seems disturbingly similar. Jetzt sind wir aber richtig drin ja. Der Höhle des Löwen. Ja, ich wollte gerade sagen. Ich wollte gerade. Ich habe eine Schuhkarte. Auf Purpose? Nicht wirklich. Ich wollte wirklich gerade sagen, hoffentlich hält mich das aus, ne? Und zack, eingebrochen. Toll. Das sah schon so verrostet aus. <lacht> naja, so soll es ja auch sein, dass euch das neugierig macht. Also ich finde es total cool. Ich werde es auf jeden Fall dann heimlich und leise weiterspielen ohne euch. <lacht> Status? Nothing's changed, Astrocator. Understood. Oh, wir haben ein Tracker-Signal. Finally, I have his position. Official? Not yet. Uh. 
Aber ich muss ich mich hier durchquetschen, oder was? Ah. Gorski, are you here? It's me, Jasna. Still nothing. Yeah. I found his backpack. You know what that means, sir? Yes, he's without oxygen. We oh, there he is. I see him. He's lying in a sinkhole. Doctor, answer me, please. Komm ich denn nicht durch? Ach, hier dafür kann ich mich jetzt nicht durchquetschen, oder was? Wow. Got him. He's not moving. Zieh ihn doch erstmal da raus. Okay, doch Atem ist da. Er atmet. Gorski, Gorski, look at me. His eyes are closed. Is he breathing? He's alive, but barely. Did he react in any way? No reaction. He seems unconscious. Gorski, come on. Calm down, Doctor. Get him out of there. The probe's already looking for a landing site. Hello, Itzy. <sighs> Okay, let me just... Uh, I'm, I'm pulling him uh, out. Uh, done. He's out. I activated his SOS. You should pick up a transmission with his parameters, sir. Well? No. Nothing. The transmitter in the suit must be too weak. Should I retrieve his booster from the backpack? Uh, no point. Better to set up a relay. We have to do it anyway so that Hopper can land in this maze. Have a preliminary scan of your surroundings. There's an open area nearby. You have to move Gorski there. The probe will guide you. But he's not stable. I must share my oxygen with him, Astrogator. You'd need a spare for that. The protocol doesn't provide for connecting two suits at the same time. In that case, I'll give him my tank. Negative. I won't allow it, Yasna. If you faint, the doctor won't carry you. Oh. The membrane looks intact. What did you say? I didn't hear. Hold on, Gorski. I still can't hear you, Doctor. Bist du nicht erst den Helm noch wieder zu machen, vielleicht? Don't be angry, sir. But. But what? Please go ahead. After. After careful consideration. Ja, bin eine kleine Rebelle. I gave Gorski my tank. We still don't know when you'll send the lander, so I can't leave him without oxygen. Doctor, I explicitly told you not to. Never mind. Never mind. Let's hope Artie can finish the job if you're both unconscious. Itzi, thank you for nine months. Thank you. Ich finde, das war nicht schlau. Ja und? Aber es war, ich durfte es machen, also. Sort of. Yes. Once you set up the transmitter, I should start it. Platziere das Relay. Wo denn? Wo denn? Wo denn? Wo denn? Wo soll ich das? Ach da. Oh Gott, ich spreche doch wieder ab hier. Äh, durch meines.
Die erste ist halt eine gute. Ja? Es wird schon passen. Hat. Okay, so, hey, I, I'm underground. It's hard to determine my exact location. Novik, do you copy? Base, come in. I'm sending an SOS. Anyone, please. Okay. Mm, thank you so. Just keep it together. Heartbeats racing. The mm -hmm. saturation hasn't dropped below the tissue norm. Not yet, at least. Ich muss euch aber doch ziemlich viel zeigen, ha? Huh? Von dem Spiel. Wir sind schon seit zweieinhalb Stunden am Spiel. Deposit of water. Probably unsafe for consumption. I'd rather not risk it. Ups. Shit. Obala. Let's hope it's not fossil. <lacht> Ups. Ich wusste nicht, dass ich da untertauche. Slippery terrain. Poor visibility. Considering all factors. Situation. Hopeless. At least I got flat. Oh, come on. Gotta be kidding me. Nun. I see nothing, nothing, nothing. Einfach nothing, nothing, nothing. Links oder rechts? Links oder rechts? Links oder rechts? Ja. Kann ich links überhaupt? Nee. Wir wollten doch hoch. Keine Chance. Tiefer Abgrund. Enger Durchgang. Machst du bitte deine Augen wieder auf? Jasna? Who's that? I, I can't see. Crowder. Is that you? But how? You, you were supposed to... Doctor? Why won't you answer me? Yes. 
It's good to see you again, Yasna. Unfortunately, there is no time for pleasantries. We need to get out of here now. Wenn ich jetzt gefragt hätte, ob es der andere ist, ob der dann auch geantwortet hat? How are we supposed to do that? You're way up. Look to your left. Should be easier from there. I'll keep an eye on you from above. You won't lose me if we stay in contact. And hopefully both of us will make it to the Ja, Herr Thun? I'm not going anywhere. Until you explain how you found me. Then I guess you'll die. Because I refuse to waste time on explanations. Your choice, Yasna. <laughs> awesome. Schön vorsichtig, Jasna. Schön vorsichtig. Durchgang, jawohl. Unten. Crowder, say something. I can't stand this dreadful silence. Silence is harmless. You shouldn't be afraid of it. Unlike other things. And what should I be afraid of? Dehydration, hypoxia, methane poisoning. The list is quite long. Oh, what were you thinking, really? I warned you against opening your helmets, let alone giving all your oxygen to a dead man. A complete failure of reason in the act of futile heroism. Gorski isn't dead. That's why I left him my damn tank. Yeah, you might as well be. Do you really think giving him oxygen was enough? Something attacked you up there. Odds are, it got Gorski as well. We'll check and come back for him. Novik should be monitoring his parameters after all. Yeah, about that. You shouldn't trust everything the old man says. He only tells us what he sees fit. Huh? What do you mean? Doesn't matter now. Let's focus on getting out of this maze. Is your equipment operational? Nothing damaged? I think so. Flares are wet though. What equipment do you have on you? Procedural minimum or more? The telemeter, tracer, a metal detector. Other than the latter, I. I Say the bare minimum. I wonder why they don't give us proper torches. Tell me about it. Das habe ich mich auch schon gefragt. Taschenlampe wo? Uh, slow down. I need to rest. Uh, rest is for the dead. <lacht> Der typische Spruch. <lacht> <lacht> Platsch, die dritte. Nein, ich hatte genug. Oh, ja, ist noch. Genug. Vor die Jasna. Halt durch. Vor die Jasna. Wir reisen gegen die Zeit, Jasna. Wir kämpfen ständig für Leben, Jasna. Genug von diesem Nonsen. Ich will nicht mehr kämpfen. Ich will nicht mehr kämpfen. All right, Yasna. Have it your way. What? A moment ago you were forcing me to struggle on. But now you'll let me die. Just like that. Uh, not just like that. You did everything you could. 
But even that wasn't enough. <laughs> it was a right to finally give up. No. No, not over. I haven't given up yet. Can you walk? Yeah. Probably. I just need to catch my breath. On second thought, I imagine there are worse places to die. It's rather peaceful, actually. Just close your eyes and let yourself go. Fall asleep. Okay. Nine. I'm getting up. <laughs> Turns out I prefer to live than let you talk me to death. <laughs> I still don't know if I can make it. You have to. Okay. I'll make it. Somehow. That's the spirit. <laughs> Thank goodness. Du siehst überhaupt nichts. Nee, hier darf ich nicht durch. Hä? Hä, ich muss aber. aber von wo bin ich denn gerade gekommen? Ah. All my talking turned out to be quite helpful, huh? Don't push it, Crowther. Do you see this? Well, if you're talking about the cold deposits and the bones of prehistoric reptiles, then yes, they're further up as well. What do you think that means? Isn't it obvious? Dinosaurs once lived on Regis 3. Don't mock me, Crowther. No, I'm serious. Millions of years ago, this planet had to be teeming with life. Until und dann kamen irgendwelche Autos und haben alles kaputt gemacht. Or it didn't allow organisms ashore. Perhaps stop them from leaving the water. Wo, woher bin ich denn gekommen? So, I think it stops them to this day. In Hilfe. other words, it's still here. And it nips all manifestations of life in the bud. Why then have I not met it yet? Ich sehe gar nichts, ne? Ich muss in, ins OBS gucken. <lacht> you know a lot, Crowther. About what happened to me, and about these fossils. The old man told me. About life on Regis. About you. He's clueless regarding Regis. Jetzt gehe ich ja wieder runter. Nee, warte mal, jetzt bin ich im Kreis gelaufen. Ich bin im Kreis gelaufen. Ich dachte, ich komme irgendwie da rüber. Na toll. Äh. <lacht> Einfach nur hier reinlaufen müssen. Even more skeletons. Annoyingly now, there are no cons. Nobody will know of this discovery if we get stuck here. Relax. The old man will send another expedition. And they will find those bones. <lacht> Neben unseren Super. For a moment there I forgot how screwed I was. Good that you reminded me. Maybe your situation would be better if you didn't stop to admire the fossils. Now you sound like Novik. <lacht> Too shame. Da steht er wieder. Natürlich wieder auf der anderen Seite. Ich bild mit denen nur ein. How 
was it? You're always a few steps ahead of me. Simple. I outpace you because I'm moving my legs, not my mouth. <laughs> wow. Come. It's time to be among other people again. They are there, somewhere. I promise. I'm starting to have second thoughts. What if something's waiting for me? Something that caused my fall? Uh, it doesn't matter now. You stay. Hey, where did you go? Der war ja nur Einbildung, das wissen wir ja. I can't go with you anymore. Crowder? Forgive me for my rudeness. I had to be a prick to pull you out of there. Unfortunately, now my body is near coal, empty water, and nitrogen, and empty hearts. I'd like to come out. This is not our farewell, but so I should tell you, it was an honor to serve with you. I, I'm here. Over. Finally! Yes, sir. You can't even imagine. It's really good to hear your voice again, Doctor. Sir? I saw Crowther. Yes, sir. Are you saying... <clears throat> what? Uh, I don't quite understand myself. All right. I see that for now. Are you injured in any way? Uh, no. <clears throat> As usual. I came out of trouble unscathed. So wie es. Es kam auch immer irgendwas schon davon. I'm not calling it anything until I'm out of here, sir. Understood. Please continue. We'll talk later. Bin ich jetzt schon draußen? Also bin ich ist das jetzt schon die Oberfläche oder darf ich noch ein paar Schritte laufen? Bin da noch nicht raus. Ich darf bestimmt noch ein bisschen, oder? Ein Schritt noch. What the? What kind of deadly shit is this? Doctor, what are you talking about? There's something here. It looks like a machine. It burned a hole in the wall. And I was watching all these kind of. Krablecks. Wir hatten vorhin was von der Riesenkrabbe gesagt. Ich erkenne das wieder. I recognize this noise. It's a damn thing that dropped me underground. Ah. I even have a suspicion of what exactly we're dealing with. One of the flagship machines of the Alliance would match the description. Walking antimatter cannon. Antimatter. Oh, fuck. Yes, indeed. Tja, Leute. Do you still have a visual on the object? Bei dem Erfolg stand aber gerade, dass ich die Maschinen an der Oberfläche gefunden habe. Deswegen, ich glaube, ich darf hier leider nicht mehr weiterspielen. Tut mir leid. <lacht> Müsst ihr selber machen. I'm sorry.